ARA2 Melodyne integration in Pro Tools gives you another tool for adjusting the timing of audio within your session with speed and precision. To enable Melodyne on a track or clip in Pro Tools, right-click on the track or clip and select Melodyne Edit. This will analyze the audio and open it in the Melodyne tab in the docked editor. Make sure to enable the options Follow Selection in DAW and Zoom to Selection in DAW for easier navigation. To quickly edit the timing for the entire track or individual clips, click on the Quantize Time macro button and adjust the intensity slider with no blobs selected. If you want to target specific notes, select the blobs that you want to affect. For more detailed timing adjustments, select the main tool and click in the middle of the blob to move it using Melodyne's current time grid. For finer adjustment, hold the Option key on the Mac or Alt key on Windows and freely move the blob to the desired location. The note can be shortened or lengthened by clicking on the front end of a blob and dragging. These edits will be locked to the grid or use the Option or Alt modifier key to move freely to the desired location. All changes can be bypassed by either clicking on the Compare button in the Melodyne Editor or right-clicking on the track or clip in selecting Melodyne Bypass. Changes can be deleted by right-clicking on the track or clip in Pro Tools and selecting Melodyne Clear, selecting Restore Original from the Edit menu in the Melodyne Editor, or right-clicking on a blob and selecting Restore Original for specific notes. To make any changes permanent, right-click on the track or clip in Pro Tools and select Melodyne Render. With you, I get lost for days.